Here goes. And it says on the clock, 150 yards. She's out cold, is it, or on the egg? Wait, guess we're on the counter. Come on. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, oh, thank goodness, I thought we'd lost her. It's all that strong lacquer she uses on her hair, it slowed the ball down. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Miss Brahms. Uh, don't worry, it'll be all right. Where am I? Well, you're with your friends at work. Work? What do you mean, work? I'm still at school. No <laughs> idea. It's a serious brain injury. You mean you don't know where you are? I, I've no idea. This is the ladies and gentlemen's department in Grace Brothers, and I'm Captain Peacock. But what am I doing here? Well, you've worked here for years. I want to go home to my mummy. <laughs> Can you remember your name? My name's Betty. But my mummy says I mustn't talk to strange men. <laughs> you can talk to me. Now, <laughs> what is the date? I've no idea. Well, uh, who's the Prime Minister? Mr Chamberlain. <laughs> well, I'm surprised it wasn't Gladstone. <laughs> right. She's obviously lost her, lost her memory. We've got to try and get it back gradually. Well, how gradually? We could all be old men before she remembers how old she is. <laughs> you treat her gently. With someone who thinks they're still at school when she's over 50. Well, I don't know. Come on, come on, Betty, we must help you off the counter. No, no, no. I want him to do it. <laughs> come along, Mrs. Slocum. Catch! Oh. <laughs> oh, who is this nice man? Oh, that's Mr. Walpole from Sports. Uh, now, Mrs. Slocum, I suggest you go and lie down for a bit. Who's Mrs. Slocum? You are. Oh, are we playing mummies and daddies? <laughs> That's me! Hang on, hang on, hang on. Now, now, Betty, now, 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 look, now, just feel there. Look, can you feel that bump on your head? Yes. You were hit on the head with a golf ball, and you've temporarily lost a teeny-weeny little bit of your memory. And all you can remember is being a little girl. Is that correct? Well, if we're going to pretend, and I work here, what do I do? Well, you're a junior, of course. <laughs> On the ladies' counter. You work under the big girl, Miss Brahms. <laughs> Am I satisfactory so far? Oh, you've done very well. Now, why don't you go and have a lie down in the fitting room for a bit? Yes, come along, Betty. Let's go see who's in the listening corner today. <laughs> <laughs> I'd better go and find another practice ball mechanism. The one we've got is obviously faulty. 